Hey guys, Destin Legary here, walking you through Act 3, Chapter 1 of Gears of War 3. We met up with Dizzy, and he's having a good time. He seems healthy. And he helped us get here, where we're helping out an old, old buddy. Well, you must think it's pretty damn urgent. Hell, I'd almost given up on the damn thing. Yeah, it contains information where Prescott's holding my father, Azura. Ring any bells with you? What in the hell do you mean holding your father? I got a message from him. He didn't get killed after all. Prescott had him kidnapped. Dear God Almighty, and all that shit's on the disc? Well, where'd you get the key? Prescott handed it to me today, just before he died. Goddamn idea what to say. And that's a first for me. Contact! Grubs at the front gate! All personnel to stand through position! I'll fill you in after we've dealt with our visitors. Load up and meet me at the front gate. Alright, so right away, there are people storming the gate. But there's plenty of ammunition laying around. And you know what that means? Pick up any gun you can find and just start mowing down the locusts. So get ready for them to come through. Don't stay on this turret. See, I thought, oh, they're going to come through the doorway. Well, I'll be ready for them. No, there's actually three doorways, and they can come back further and further each time. So just grab some good weapons, get out there, and start shooting. Well, I think we might have pissed them off. We ran into the queen. So I grab the one shot, bring it all the way over here, only to find that I can't really use it seeing that big wall's in my way. So I decided to just drop it and it goes flying somewhere. All you need to do is do your best to hold off the locust at this point. Stay in cover and shoot as you can. trying to do, pick up the one shot, so I can take that guy out, and instead I use the hammer of dawn, when I finally heal, there, he's taken care of, but the hammer of dawn's been adjusted a little bit, now it has, like, ammunition or something, so you can only use it a limited amount of times. I get a little bit confused here because uh, I haven't really played too much since one. Well, I beat the second one. But I get to try out a new weapon and take out two grinders at the same time. That was rewarding. So I'm just kind of looking around for like what weapon's breaching the gate. It looks to me like everything's dead. And I just decide to start shooting at the locust right there by the door. Don't forget that if they are coming up on the walls, you can shoot the hooks and they won't be able to climb up.
You cannot kill the siege beast. Don't waste your ammunition. <laughs> first gate has been breached due to the siege beast, which I couldn't really do too much about. So you need to fall back and get on the next turret or grab the next big weapon that'll help you out. Hammer Dawn's useless to me now, so I grab something different. The boom shot will actually be slightly effective here because you got a few bigger enemies that you can hit really easily and you'll take all the people around them. I think there are some turrets here on the left and right that you could also use. This is kind of a fun part. I mean, it's like Locust Mode, but I'll bet on any of the harder difficulties you're having a lot of trouble right now. I'm running low on ammo. I'm using my Gorgon pistol to take down the people that are still there. But for the most part, these guys are pretty easy. I'm not too concerned with the smaller guys. It's but I hear somebody big coming through the doorway, and I focus all my fire on him. Now I figure while he's by the door, I'll try and grenade him. And I get a bunch of them, which is nice. Come on, drop them. Yeah, we're dropping them, but they've invited all their cousins. All right, got some ammo. Time to get back into the fight. Now, I kind of blew it with those grenades. I had more, I had enough time to aim, which is what I should have done. Because I didn't, these guys are going to reach the next wall. Now you can fall back and hop on this fun little turret and just mow them down. The turret uses the uh, cooldown feature. So if you overheat it, just make sure you cool it down as you go. And if you start getting hit really bad, just take cover for a while. So now they're up here, meaning they've breached the main tower. Don't forget, they can use those hooks to climb up and get in your face. I think this, I think this guy with a pistol beat down. And then a chainsaw. So we got some boomers, and I'm like, whoops, time to focus some fire on them.
So listen to the bossy lady and fall back to the garage where you can take out the last few waves of enemies. Now they're all in one area. This would be a really good spot to throw a grenade. Anytime people are bunched up like this, you can throw a weapon like a grenade and get the maximum amount of kills you possibly could. I decided to just mow them down with uh, my Lancer though. got a few boomers coming in yet that need to be taken down. Don't forget, you have places you can fall back to. You can fall back to the left or the right if necessary. Now I'm pretty much down to my pistol. said hit that fuel tank and you will be done with this area All right, and we are approaching the end of Act 3, Chapter 1 of Gears of War 3. I hope I helped you out, but if you're looking for another part of the walkthrough or you need some tips finding collectibles or something, be sure to check out IGN.com. Colonel, we better have that talk now.